It's not fair. She killed my minions. We weren't expecting her to actually do anything. And I just got those minions. It's just not fair, Merrick. It's okay. But it wasn't my fault. No, it wasn't. Now I'm sad. And why don't you go kill someone? That always makes you happy. Can I? Of course you can, my dear. Now go forth and find yourself a victim. These are not the American Andrew that you recognize. It's been months, and there's been a lot that's been going on. Some things that you need to understand and need to know before you can continue on this journey with us. We're the Knights of Grey. This is part of the sad tale of American Andrew. Give me peace when I'm dead, friend. Why would we even want to join you? Because I will shower you with gold. This guy I don't like. What? I don't know. I can just feel it in my stomach. I don't know what you're talking about. He seems fine. He's gonna pay us. We finally found someone who actually knows what they're doing out here. And he did know what he was doing. The first part of the deception of Merrick and Adriel was to find two trolls, Rank and Gutter. Funny thing about troll skin, standard weapons do not affect them. And when Merrick and Adriel demanded that they joined or died. They said they were from Lord Nightbringer, but the trolls swore that Nightbringer had died two years before. They made a deal. One of them go get Nightbringer, while the other one made sure they didn't run. Merrick went because he was the fastest. Lord Nightbringer? Um, we didn't get the trolls. What you mean you did not hold trolls? Well, they're, they didn't believe that you were alive. They said you were dead. I'm standing they, here. Well, I can see that. But our weapons don't hurt them. How difficult is it for you to go and get some trolls? I said either they join or they die. It is that simple. Well... That's not my fault I have crap for weapons. What the hell was that for? You never speak to me in such a way again. Take this. It will pierce the troll's skin. Now go and retrieve them and bother me no more. 
Little did Merrick know as he ran down the path that all of this was a trap, and the sword that he carried in his hand was none other than Dark Heart, a very cursed weapon. The trolls had been working for Nightbringer all along, and as soon as Merrick left and Adriel was alone, they attacked her. They beat her and ate upon her flesh, and left her beaten and bloody. When Merrick found her, she was barely conscious. When she awoke, Merrick told her about the sword, and she wanted revenge. Now when they went back, the story was different. Adriel slaughtered both the trolls and left their carcasses along the road. Unfortunately, anyone who uses Darkheart loses their soul every time they kill with it. Slowly but surely, Adriel started to change. Now she is Nightshade, the poisonous puppet of the Nightbringer. And Merrick is left alone. He was saved by Lightning Jack, who brought him to us. And he works for us still. And he never rests until he can find a way to save his love. He's gone through some changes too. And we'll get to that, I promise. But for now, let's get back to this new one. This direction will lead you to power, fame, fortune, pretty much everything else you could imagine. This direction will lead you to peace. You're kidding, right? <laughs> I remember thinking the same thing, but no. I'm not kidding. So what you're telling me is that if I go this way, I get fame, fortune, gold, wine, whatever the hell I want. If I go this way, I get peace? Yeah. I have a knife, you know. If it makes you feel better. Why are you following me anyway? I'm just walking down the same path you are. But aren't you supposed to be guarding crossroads back there? What crossroads? Gone. What's gone? <laughs> You've already made your choice. I don't understand. You will. Wait! So, what's going on? It's a wonderful question. It's one DM should probably answer. DM? Who's DM? DM's the guy I work for. DM? It's Latin for day. So what is this thing? It appears to be a weapon. But it's squishy. Looks can be deceiving. What does that mean? Well, for example, look around you. Are you doing that? I'm not. Then who is? You are. No, I'm, I'm not. I think I would know. Okay. So where are we going? Um, I thought we'd go meet the guys. So I get to meet this DM, right? Well, he'll definitely be there. So who is this DM? I told you, it's the guy I work for. Yeah, but who is he? It's one of the only men I trust. So where is he? Right over there. 